every citizen of India why Indians should never take their freedom for granted. So you will read it. I will do that, sir. Of course, sir, there are so many things that uh, need to be highlighted here in this letter. But one bit, I would want to read that out for you. Because sir has written it in a way that he has written it in a way that he has written it in a way that he has written it. So it is August 16, 1947. It is a note to those who selflessly gave their all so that we can breathe free. The moment I heard of these shocking events from a village elder, I realized there is so much about our past that we still don't know. Our mind is trained to not think beyond what we have read in history textbooks, weaving folklore and reality together. August 16, 1947 was a chapter of independence that touched my heart. And for the sake of our forefathers and our country's history, I thought we must seek an apology. This is to be noted. We must seek an apology for the events of August 16, 1947 from the British. I would like to conclude this address with one small thought. As we look at India's bright present and brighter future, let us never forget the journey that got us to where we are. Of course, where we are standing together. Let us never ignore the battles that brought us to where we are. Jai Hind, Jai Bharat, A.R. Murgadas. Ladies and gentlemen, this copy will be reached to you.